Hi everyone, Akshaya here from Microsoft's 32-bit microcontrollers group. Today's digest is all about developing applications on the PIC32, CK, SG01 and GC01 family. These 32-bit microcontrollers feature an ARM Cortex-M33 core, integrate security, robust connectivity and performance features, making them ideal for industrial, automotive, medical, and other communication applications. The PIC32 CK SG01 family includes features such as integrated hardware security module, cryptographic accelerators, secure boot, authentication, and secure key storage. It is cost effective and comparable to SAM E5X and D5X family, offering enhanced security with HSM and a range of connectivity options. These MCUs are available in various options such as PIC32 CK SG01 and PIC32 CK GC01 in 64, 100 and 144 LED TQFP packages. It enables application development with robust security and high performance connectivity options. It also supports application development using a rich software libraries, middlewares and application demos using MPLAB Harmony V3 and MCC. It offers CPU clock speeds up to 120 MHz and up to 2 MB flash and 512KB SRAM. We have a variety of development boards like the PIC32 CKSG Curiosity Ultra Development Board to get you started quickly. Check out the links in the description for more information. Jumpstart your application development using the MPLABX ID and MCC. Open the MPLABX ID, go to File menu and click on New Project. Provide PIC32 CK 2051 SG 01144 as the device name. Follow the on screen instructions to complete the project creation. Use Content Manager to download the packages for the peripherals and the middleware libraries that you need for the project. Generate the code and build the application. Don't worry, we have a ton of resources including application demos and tutorials to help you build amazing things. Head down to the description for links for getting started with the PIC32 CK SG01 and GC01 family and unlock the potential for the next project. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more 32-bit MCU Digest.